Hello everyone, are you ready for another fucking adventure? It's me, Wookie here, and I'm here with another Dokkan video. Now, uh, I'm not feeling the greatest right now in terms of overall mood and actual body. I just don't feel very good, which is why I took a I took a little break yesterday because I literally there yeah, was no. I'm gonna do my best here to try and be funny. Um. But if I can be 100% real with you, not in the greatest of moods, but we press forward. And that's why I'm pressing forward with this team, really putting just everything in my hands that um, uh, GT Vegeta, which is what I'll be calling him in this video. Actually, he's the only Vegeta. Vegeta, as I'll be calling him, because that is his name. Don't ever let anyone else tell you otherwise. And you'll never hear me calling him anything otherwise on this channel because that always uh, tags a very unfortunate videos to this um, We're gonna be using artificial life forms to take on full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku The reason in my head was I'm pretty positive that Vegeta lost his full power Goku at some point and because he he monkey I have the Donkey Kong 64 soundtrack in the background so enjoy the monkey as we fight a monkey um obviously we have this advantage in terms of um uh our class but it should be fine because the lead up there is super easy also this real though has literally zero i just literally pulled him he's at sa1 don't expect much from him kind of like actual real though in the show so there we go Oh man, I still can't believe Rildo has multiple units under his name. And one of them is extremely fantastically good. I'm just saying, man, where's the wow Vegeta you straight up fucking rocked Goku there? Great. I mean, I need a certain video length. Actually, you know what, I don't. Um, if this ends up being short, then it just ends up being short. I honestly tried. I thought that the team wouldn't be that good, but then I underestimated the power of an LR. And specifically, LR Monkey. The strongest of. What are you, Abomination? I think you're Rose. Even you're gonna be dunking on Goku. Wow. Is this even gonna be longer than three minutes? I'm gonna guess now. Oh, okay, no, this will. This will take some time. This is a very bad rotation. Or perhaps the greatest rotation. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that works for me. Go in there. Now, of course, Goku right now is fighting the full power of Monkey, as far as you can see. Is this supposed to be like... No, this isn't supposed to be like Vegeta fighting all these people at the same time. That's not how that looks like no maybe he never did fight full power because now that I think about it Vegeta's on the enemy side uh, when the hell did this motherfucker show up then he must be shadow dragons I don't know man full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku looks exactly the same as Super Saiyan 4 Goku so you'll forgive me if I don't 100% know where the fuck he came from Some dramatic ass music right now. Uh, I mean, it doesn't really matter. Second like rotation literally does not matter. Go here. Yeah, I'm not feeling the best in the world. I mean, that shows. But I feel like, regardless, a video should go up. One, a break for a day is perfectly good. Uh, hopefully, by tomorrow, I should be fully operational once again. I'll feel pretty good, and here we go, the reveal of Monkey, and I'll go back to two videos a day for a bit until the weekends. I think I'm comfortable with trying to do two videos a day, and then the weekends chill, or have release a longer video. I don't know. I'm still figuring shit out, honestly. If I can, once again, this is the realest. Why am I being the realest on a video that is the most dumbest idea I could come up with? Are you going to kill him in one hit? Uh, Vegeta, because if you are, that'd be hilarious. 
pretty damn close. Man, let me tell you, I was extremely disappointed when I pulled him, but do not let my disappointment fool you. Vegeta is an extremely good LR. <laughs> He's self-sufficient, his animations suck, but then when he go monkey, his animations are pretty fun. His team is stupid, but it could be dumber, if that makes sense. Um, he transforms, which makes that one Super Battle Road stage just like child's play. Are you just gonna win? Are you just gonna win here, Vegeta? Are you gonna do that for me and then make this an extremely short video? Man, really? Five minutes? Is that really all it is right now? <laughs> no, it's gonna be six minutes. Oh, he's not going to be able to finish it. Oh, well, he had to have critted to actually finish it. Okay, so he maybe he lives for another turn. It's not like he's going to be able to kill me right here anyway. Unless you crit. Abomination, will you crit? No. You're going to fucking kill him, though. Yeah, he's dead. So there you go. There we go. Team Monkey. Really, I should have used... Um... Tapion, but... Nobody's running that team. <laughs> Literally no one runs a friend lead for for giant form unless they're running Ribrian, in which case they're not running it. It's something completely else. So yeah, that's the video. You know, I feel kinda bad leaving it off so soon. Maybe I should do a summon. No. Because I realized I need to save that for something else. I mean, uh, you know what? At least 10 minutes is good. Well, let me do this here, huh? I haven't done this at all, so we'll go in through here. So, yeah. Uh, you know, I'm just tired. I'm very tired. You can hear it in my voice. But, again, I should be perfectly fine. Don't feel... I mean, if you want to feel bad for me, feel bad for me. I'm not going to stop you from having empathy, and I think that's important to have in a person. Personally, I think. But, um, you don't have to worry. Don't, like, be scared for me. I'll be fine. I'm just... I'm just tired, man. Work... Work really got me. In, uh... In an extremely hard way. In a way that hasn't happened... I guess really before in the past. Or anything, really. It's weird. It's a very weird feeling, but I'm relaxing. I've been playing a lot of Resident Evil 2, actually, to talk about something a little bit more upbeat. I recently got that. That game was a little pretty fun. Um, I'm very tired right now, and playing it makes me feel more tired as I constantly like um, go around the map and do other dumb stuff like... Like, I, I'm, like, circling around the place, and I'm like, where the fuck do I go? And then I go, like, oh, there was a ladder here the entire time. It's not the game's fault that I'm tired and stupid and dumb. I mean, it shouldn't be its fault, really. If I'm that way, it's because I'm that way. But I definitely, like, in my head, I was just like, ah, oh, God. Everything. But it's a lot of fun. I never actually played original uh, Resident Evil 2. Uh, so I don't know how it compares to the original. But as a first timer, I can say really good. A lot of my uh, Resident Evil experience starts from Resident Evil 4. It's only Resident Evil 4 and 5, really. I never really played Resident Evil 1 because I didn't have a PS1. Um, and I only got a PS2 super late in life, so Resident Evil, I missed the first three and a whole bunch of other ones on the side. I never played the GameCube remake, even though I had a GameCube and I had Resident Evil 4. But the idea was is because I was super scared, so I'm like, I'm not going to get this super scary game because I'm going to be super scared. And I don't want to be super scared. And then I eventually learned that it's fine. And um, I do super, I do, <laughs> the game really does make me jump. There's a bunch of times where uh, Mr. X um, shows up and I'm just like, ah, oh, shit. Or when I'm like, I need to run and I'm tired of like, it's the idea of just like, 
yeah, you can be super cautious, but also I need to hurry the fuck and go somewhere else. And then I'm running all around it, and then it's like, ah, crap, I got attacked by someone. And, you know, it's fun. And I've only played Leon's story so far, so I'll definitely give a, a look-see at um, Claire's story and finish it off, I think. Yeah, those kind of games where it's just, like, infinitely repeatable, I really like. I think Resident Evil 4... It never got to Tales of Synthonia levels because I want to say I played Tales of Synthonia almost a thousand hours worth um, on my original GameCube memory card that is and that's because I kept just constantly replaying it I never got everything I, I literally never got anything I never tried to get everything like I never tried to get all the recipes all I really wanted to do was just like play with different parameters set and like experiment with stuff and you know just have fun infinite replayability in a way that's not multiplayer is something that I feel like I don't know not a lot of games do nowadays a lot of the Capcom games do because they're Japanese and I'm actually going to lose to the Cell Jr. I think I haven't been paying attention um, as I just kind of talk about Resident Evil in the background it's fine this is the, the bad team that I use for farming um the medals of these easy easy a boys that I haven't been doing just because literally work was so busy I wasn't able to do any of it so oh look at you you could transform I'm not going to though you could though so yeah that's been the one very fun part of my life I guess oh also I ended up playing some more fake grand order and tapping and you know the everything the usual suspects and so but uh haven't been doing any videos on them obviously so you don't even know about my current process at all um yeah man i hope i'm i love doing this so never feel like um if you're ever worried that i'll stop making videos don't don't be worried man i won't stop making videos unless they take my youtube channel away from me and even then i'll probably just start over again I'll make a new YouTube channel with Blackjack and Whoopers. That sounds fantastic. Anyway, with that, that's a video. I hope you enjoyed it and ended up turning into um, half grind and talk, half monkey fight. Um, when am I gonna name this video? I'm just gonna came in. I'm just gonna name it Monkey Dokkan Battle, and then it'll be a giant picture of an ape. Yeah, sounds good. Anyway, I hope you guys have a nice day, and I'll see you all more next time. Goodbye.